Hey guys, so, um, first of all, I have a weird setup going on right now. You guys can't see it yet. So, in the last video, the uh, the reaction to the Neo The World Ends With You trailer, um, I mentioned that I was going to watch the announcement back, back when it was still a countdown, and I thought it was going to be at midnight. I was going to have a live stream, and while we were waiting, I had some, uh, some Yu-Gi-Oh cards that I bought at Walmart. And I said that we would open those during the live stream. But then because it was uploaded early, I guess, earlier than I expected, um, I just decided to make it a separate video. So, I've got two things here that I bought from Walmart. I've got a Maximum Gold and uh, one of the 2020 10s of Lost Memories. I picked these up today while I was out grocery shopping. And I thought we'd oh, do an unboxing. Don't expect this to be like a regular occurrence. Like something that we do often. This just is going to be something that we do every now and then. If I if there's like a set coming out that I think is interesting and I have some extra money. Because obviously these this, these were not cheap at all, really. I mean, uh, this was the cheaper one and it was like 20 bucks. But, um, so I think we'll start, I'll start, we'll start with this one here. And I, I okay. Before we, before we begin, I'm a little scatterbrained. My setup is a mess. You might notice I'm a bit brighter, and that's because I have a lamp shining onto my desk right here. I have one of my computer monitors, like, sideways on my table so I can attach a second webcam aimed down here. And this is, like, the best angle I could get, because there was just no way for me to get any better angle. Um, it, it's, it's, it's the best we can do. And I think... I think it looks alright, like you can you can see that reasonably well. Got <laughs> multiple light angles. I might be able to let me try to move if I can move that a little bit there. Oh that's mu oh that's much better, yeah. So we can open these up real quick and I've got a pocket knife right over here. We're just gonna jump right in and we will open these up. We'll start with the tin, and we can use the tin to store the cards. So let me just make sure that everything is working right before I open it up. All right, here we go. So I actually haven't gotten Yu-Gi-Oh cards in quite a while. So this is going to be something a little different. Let me put that in the bag it came in. And I'll put the knife up for a minute. And we will open this up. And it comes with... I think four of these or something? One? No, just three. But they're massive packs. They're like, how many cards are in each one? It's like 18? Yeah. So, we will open these one at a time. And we'll see what we get. I know there's that these are like uh, reprint sets with like a bunch of reprints from the last few years. So we're just gonna, we're gonna start. And I'm gonna try to, <laughs> I'm gonna try to angle it so that you, the camera can see better. So, and I know there are even some like competitive cards in here too. All right, so the first card, we've got Morge Slog. Let me try to angle this here so we can actually see the cards somewhat better before we go in. Oh, I made it worse. Oh no, I made it worse. Hold on here. So if I hold it like that. It's not, it's not the best. <laughs> We're just going to have to make do, I think. I think, is that, I don't know, my camera's a little weird all of a sudden. Do I have like a fingerprint on there? That's weird, okay. I think once we get to this pack, I might have to check that. So we've got Morge Slog, a continuous, or not a continuous, uh, an equipped spell. We've got uh, Dwimmered Glimmer. I do not know a lot of these cards. Ooh, cool. I was hoping we could get some Link Monsters, because I only have... The only Link Monsters I have were from the the starter deck back when they first came out. So, this is kind of cool to have. We see that Extra Hero Cross Crusader. I'll actually just kind of... Yeah, I'll just put them like that. I'm going to put them on the, uh, the tin over here. The tin lid there. Uh, Gladiator Beast, Atorix... Gladiator Beasts comebacks. So we got some Guardi uh, Gladiator Beasts. Guard Dragon Shield. I see our first uh, foil card. 
uh, Whitefish Salvage, which has a nice kind of foil to it. Ooh, we got another uh, Link Monster, Test Panther. Hold on, I'm trying to get these a little more organized here. Oh, that's a Gladiator Beast card, too. Whoa, okay. I like the foil on that. That's like a secret rare. Cybers Quantum Dragon. That's a nice synchro. I really like how it's on the level, too. Witchcrafter Holiday. No material. Loge's Lo Flame. Salaman Great Foxer. Uh, Evil Eye Confrontation. Unchained Twins. Aruha. Neo Flamvel Lady. Dino Wrestler Kyra. Uh, I can't. Okay, I can't speak today. And Vessel for the Dragon Cycle. So there's our first pack. And we got. Uh, these for our foils with that being our I'm not sure what is this called the special foil on these I'm gonna set those aside for now let me just check the back real quick it's called a prismatic secret rare so it is a secret rare so we'll open the, up the second one real quick actually do I want to do the the card trick because I know let me set aside the the foils real quick and we can do like a, a card trick maybe. So it's... No, nah, I, I don't think we're going to do a card trick today. I'll put the rares and the foils aside. Alright. Here comes the next pack get this open here so we've got jelly cannon hyper psychic riser galactic spiral dragon neo space connector i didn't know these though i guess they still make the neo space monsters um Rincess current oh another uh link monster we're getting plenty of those i kind of hope we get a a, a pendulum too because i don't know if there's any of those in the set we got our first a uh, foil card, Unchained Soul of Disaster. We've got Speed Lift for our next one. Time Thief Redoer. That's a cool card. I love that. Witchcrafter uh, by Street and oh no, I can't read that. Super Anti Kaiju War Machine Mecha Thunder King. Oh my God, that is a a name. So that's our secret rare, and I want to see that card closer because that's a that is a long name. Banish one kaiju. I've heard kaijus are being used competitively, so that's cool. Uh, White Aura Monoceros, Marincis Mandarin, uh, Time Thief Bezel Ship, Guard Dragon Cor Core Awakening, Hop Ear Squadron, BES Blaster Cannon Core, and Guard Dragon Reincarnation. So that's our second pack. We'll just go into the last one here. Get this open here. So we've got Spiritual Entanglement, Marincess Battle Ocean. I see a Link Monster. Tenyi Spirit, Mapura, Salaman Great Sunlight Wolf. Oh my god. Okay, I've been playing one of the Yu Gi Oh! video games, Legacy of the Duelist, on the Switch. And this card, <laughs> I, you guys don't know if you guys can see it real well has been a pain in the butt to play against. Hold on, I'm gonna try to, I'm actually gonna wipe off my camera a little bit there, see if that helps it at all. Let's see if that fixes our problems at all. So we got that. Marincess Snow, Guard Dragon Shield, and now we're getting into the foils. We got the Marincess Seahorse, uh, Blue Tang, Danger, Agapogo. Okay, I know that Danger cards are used a lot. Witchcrafter Pottery, Get Out, Link Mail Archfiend, which is a, ooh, that's a Link 4. Uh, Exceeds Sly Dolphin, I'm going to put these here real quick. Let me look at this one real quick, because that's, I think these, I know some of the Links are, or not the Links, but the Danger cards are used competitively. Uh, Heat to the Fire Charmer, Ablaze, and we got a few others in there too. So that's 
those done and I'm going to put these into here for safekeeping for now. And then we'll open up the next tin or the, the box this time. This one I think has four packs. So here's the maximum gold and this was actually the last one they had at Walmart and I have misplaced my pocket knife. There it is. All right. Maybe next time I do this in like the future, it'll probably be a while before I do this again. Maybe we'll do it on a, a live stream or something. It's like a between thing in the future. But for now, we're just gonna do it like this. That should be good to get it open, I think, maybe. Yeah, that should suffice. Come on. Come on. There we go. Can I just pull this off maybe? Come on. There we go. Now I've seen the the foil cards in this, the the gold rares and they look really nice. So I'm just going to You know, I'm just going to cut that off. It's going to be easier. There we go. And here we go. We got four packs, two on each side. So we'll just start on the left side and work from there. And these do have less cards in them, but they are more of them. So we'll open this one up. So we've got Necro Valley Throne for our first card. Let me try to get the camera to focus here. There we go. Necro Valley Throne is our first card. Dark Lord Ixchel. Transcode Talker. Oh, Rank Up Magic the seventh one, and that does look really good. Wow. So there's our first gold rare. And there's our second one. Appaloosa. Bo okay, this is one of the cards. Wow, that does look really good. Appaloosa, I think, is one of the cards that is being used competitively right now. People are using this card a lot in competitive decks. Oh, hey, True Nate. <laughs> That's a, that looks really nice. I like how it's even, like, even the artwork itself, it's even, like, textured. Like, even the artwork on the card is has the border and it's textured. So that looks really good. I don't know how well you guys can see that. It's not, hold on, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna look at the rest of the cards and I'll show that. Mecha Phantom Beast, Colt Wing. Let me try to, let me try to show you these and how they look. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but they like, it's so, I'm at such a weird camera angle. I'll have to, if I do this again, I'm gonna have to find a way to do this better. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to have to figure this out. Alright. Next pack. If I can get it out. Come on. There we go. Alright. Let's see here. We've got... Mecha Phantom Beast Dracosec. Uh, Buster Blader the Destruction Swordmaster. Ooh, Beatrice Lady of the Eternal is our first one, and it's an Xyz monster. And also even, I think, yeah, even the, the rank on it is textured. That's really cool. And our other one. Oh, do we even? Oh, there's the other ones. Okay, I see it coming up. Uh, Condemned Witch is next. Medulce Knights. And Sky Striker Ace Kagari, that looks, that's a really good looking card. I love that. And Storming Mirror Force. That, that looks really good. So does this one too. I like both, those are both really good. I don't, I don't know. I'd have to take the time to read these. But they both look really, really well. Like I love the way the foil works on those. Uh, next up. 
is this one, and it's opening a little weird there, so I'm going to have to be, it's a little different. So we got 80, uh, number 87, Queen of the Night. The White sto uh, Stone of the Ancients. I think that's probably a, yeah, that's a Blue Eyes support card. Artifact Lancia. Oh, that looks, okay, that looks really good. I love that. Um, next up is Mistake. I'm going to try to find a safe place to put that for a second. Uh, Stardust Charge Warrior is our next one, and it's a Synchro. And Mistake and Arrest, as well as another Mecha Phantom Beast, ja ja Jacuselin. Jacuselin. I can't pronounce some of these cards. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. So there's our two for this pack. Artifact Lancia and Stardust Charge Warrior. And I'll put those there. And next. There we go. Come on. Come on. There we go. Last pack. Let's see if we can get something crazy in our last pull. I love the way that the Xyz monsters look. I think I think the uh, the Link and the Xyz monsters look best in this type of thing. So we got White Prince, Dragon's Mirror, Medulce Hoot Cake, and my cards are a little messed up there. Number 107, Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon. I actually used to collect numbers a lot, so that's pretty cool to see. Oh, we got Infinite Impermanence. Okay, this is a card I know is being used competitively. Like, this is a, a deck people are using in their side deck. So that's cool. To, oh, whoa, okay. That looks cool. Noble Knight, it, that looks so cool. We got Infinite Impermanence and a Red Eyes Black Dragon. That's probably not, like, the most competitive card, but that looks really cool. Even, like, I don't know, it looks... Almost looks a different color. Like, the card frame looks different. I don't know how to put it. That That's really cool, though. Let me try to... Let me try to lay all of these out now. All of the gold rares. So we got Rank Up Magic, the seventh one. Uh, Appaloosa, Bow of the Goddess. Uh, Beatrice, Lady of the Eternal. Uh, Sky Striker, Ace Kagari. Artifact, Lancia. Stardust Charge Warrior, as well as uh, these two. I don't know how best to show these. <laughs> There's not a good way to do this. I have to figure out a better way to do this for the future. So I'm going to get these kind of set aside somewhere safer. And then we'll take one last look at the cards in the tin. At the foils specifically. We got Danger, Ogopogo, and a bunch of... Oh, kind of got... That one kind of got mixed in there. I, I love the, the foil on these two. I always like the, the black on the these monsters i also i think the white on the synchro monsters looks good too though so i think that's about done then oh wow is it been 20 minutes wow i keep saying that these videos are going to be like five ten minutes and they end up going for seven minutes i thought the same thing with the neo world ends with you video too so that was cool um like i said previously i don't expect to be doing this all that often because obviously these cards cost fair amount of money uh so don't expect it too horribly often it's really just going to be when i feel like buying some cards i'm just going to open them on here instead of just on my own so that's going to be the the way i do it maybe we could do some other stuff too i don't know just you know if you if you like this and you want to see more let me know um if i do more i will figure out a better way to record it i actually kind of have a couple of ideas about ways i could do it better this was just kind of put together at the last minute so I, I will find something better in the future uh let me know and then i it, like i said it probably won't be for a while it's just going to be when i have some extra money and maybe there's some card sets that look interesting to me i could almost buy another maximum gold or something but you know i'm really glad i got infinite permanent that's a cool card all right i'll see you guys in the next video take care